Did you get you guys met obviously in Lost Boys, right? We did, yeah. Did you meet like in how, how did you meet? Do you remember the day you met? I, I don't specifically remember the day. I know it was up in we shot the film in two places. We shot it in Los Angeles and we shot it in Santa Cruz in the very, very beginning. And and in Santa Cruz, it felt very disjointed. Uh, there were two units. Uh, it didn't feel as cohesive an experience, for me at least, uh, when we got back to Los Angeles. So I know kind of when I met Jason, it was like, hi, this is Jason. He's playing da 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 da. And it's like, hello, and here's your mark. And hey, well, Nice, really nice meeting you, man. I'm, I'm, I'm thrilled to be working with you. Okay, and look over there, and okay, rolling, you just know, like it, that. It was kind of like that, and I remember we became. <laughs> he's looking at like, well, I remember it a little differently. You remember? Uh, it? Well, it, he's right in that it was disjointed, and it really probably was just a handshake hello. But I do remember that I actually had my birthday up there because my birthday is on June seventeenth, and I turned twenty. And they'd made me a cake. Uh, I guess it was me on a motorcycle or something like that. And everyone said happy birthday and all that. And I specifically remember Kiefer coming up and taking the knife and just cutting my head off for his piece of the cake, <laughs> taking a walk away. <laughs> now, that was before we worked together. And then the first day that we actually Perfect. worked together is the first day those characters meet in the film. Yeah. That night yeah. on the motorcycle. Yeah. Did you hit it off right away or was there, you know, there's always that thing, I hope this guy's fucking cool. I hope he's not a hothead. The end of that, just, by the end of that night, I think. Yeah, I think question, so too. I mean, by I was, the end of that night. I really appreciated the fact when I first read the script of Lost Boys, um, you know, I came from the world of get whatever job you can and just deal with it later. Right. Uh, but Lost Boys was written for much younger characters. Uh, they weren't supposed to be in their 20s. They were all supposed to be kind of Peter Panish, 13, 12, 13 year olds. And and Joel had made the change that he wanted it to be kind of 20, kind of early 20s and, and, and stuff like that. And so a lot of the dialogue had to change. And I really appreciated how seriously Jason took it, you know, the, that he was there to try and make the best film he could. This wasn't I need this much money to get me to my next job. This was, how, how do we make this really cool and special? And so he did a lot of, you know, Joel Schumacher, who uh, we both kind of love and adore, but he did a lot of the battling with Joel, uh, kind of on behalf of the rest of us to make the script what it ultimately became and, and, and justifying certain actions for our characters, et cetera, et cetera. And so... I really appreciated that he took the lead on that and that he was kind of an adult, serious actor. Because uh, a lot of the stuff that I had done, I'd done with very young people. Like right. Stand By Me was right. with 11, 12-year-olds who were amazing, by the way. And, yeah. and they were fantastic. And you were young, too. I was 18, 19, yeah. Yeah, yeah I, was a year, I was a year younger than Jason. And so you guys would get, uh, as, a, as a collective, you and Amy, Amy? Gertz, Jamie, 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 Jamie. Jamie Gertz. Yeah, fuck me. I, you know, I make mistakes. But you guys would all get together and go this, 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 and you'd be the guy, the point man, to sort of talk to Joel about it. I think sometimes, but it was more that I spent a lot of time with Joel because he tried to get me in the movie for a long time. And once we started going, because I had a lot to do, it was always about the piece, whoever else was in it. So if I felt that there was an issue that it wasn't quite working. It was more going to Jamie or going to Kiefer and say, what do you feel about this or this? I would never speak for them. And then uh, then I would take the lead and go in there and say, look, you know, and I got to say, look, Lost Boys is Lost Boys because of Joel. Now I'm not, and when I say that, I mean, he got the guy who shot Raging Bull and Taxi Driver, Michael Chapman. You know, that guy doesn't come off that and shoot teen vampire movies, but Joel got him. He got Bo Welch, who was an amazing production designer. Mm. And then he got all these actors. He get Diane Weist right off an Oscar, Ed Herman, Bernard Hughes, you know, and young guys like me and Kiefer. Um, so, and he would be open to those ideas and open to dialogue and to make it interesting and different. I think the reason the movie has lasted is because of that effort and because of the involvement of the people that he picked and our relationship as adversaries Grew. But as I said, after that first night, we were thick pals for the next. Did you guys yeah, go months. out a lot? Did you party? We used to go out. They <laughs> We'd did. go out for lunch in our makeup. You got to tell that story. Makeup. We're 
we were sitting in driving a, off the Warner Brothers lot in we, his we convertible so, Mustang. Mo, no Porsche. And, Tell the story. And it's oh yeah, <laughs> it's it was an old. It wasn't. A, it was an old 1979 T. It was All an right. old old Porsche. Um and and we were in full vampire makeup, but we had. We just couldn't have any more of the catering lunch, and we just wanted to go get a burger or something. And so we pulled out. Who's with you? Me, just, just me and Jason. Just the two of you. Yeah. In full right. vampire makeup, <laughs> and these girls pulled up. And I guess we'd been, wear, we'd been wearing the makeup so long that we forgot it was on. Yeah, we couldn't see it in each other. And the two <laughs> girls in the car next to us, we were like, hey, how you doing? And they just looked. They did not appreciate it. They <laughs> called us a variety of names and squealed out. Literally, the light <laughs> turns green. We're looking over as 19-year-olds in the Porsche and everything. And right when the light turned green, they just look at us and say, pigs. Pigs, yeah. And drove right off. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. That's a perfect day. It's a perfect lunch. Yeah. 